intro because I don't feel like doing the whole intro. But today is May 3rd. Happy May. I'm going to go to movies for the counter again. We're going to go watch Dungeons and Dragons Odyssey VIP. We weren't going to go out to the movies because there wasn't any movies available to the theaters that we usually go to. But I found it. He's like, yeah, let's go. Like when I tell you he really is bougie and he's not going to the movie theaters, it's not VIP. He's not going. Um, Mario was an exception because it was AVX and it was last minute and we wanted to watch uh, Mario. But other than that, he's a VIP babe. <laughs> so the movie starts at 6.15. It's currently 5.00. 13 or 14 right now i'm gonna leave the house now it takes me about an hour to get there i'm going to cinema varsity i've never been to that one but it's where we have lauren young if you're from here where the chick-fil-a is at i'm gonna see y'all when i'm downtown because i got to leave now so yeah peace i'm here i'm up on my house kind of lost i don't know why cineplex downtown they're in buildings like i just want to get to the movie theaters guys 6 16. this is the earliest i've been for the movies Ooh, there it is. I was here like 10 minutes, but I got lost. I got lost. Yo, shut up. <laughs> I was done the movie. You stay side eyeing me, fam. It was really good. Tell the camera what you think about the movie. It was I. It was I vibe. It was a bit too long for me, but I actually really enjoyed it towards the end. My only issue is that that was not VIP. At Yo, the VIP. scam at Varsity is crazy. Like, the movie theaters are like pinch. No recliners. The only thing VIP about that VIP was the food and we didn't get food. We don't like, we get little one-two things as you guys know, but today we just wanted the burgers. I didn't tell you guys, but we're getting burgers. He's shaking his head. Nothing about the burgers, the VIP. This pisses <laughs> me off. If it wasn't, like if it wasn't two for one today, yeah, I would be so pissed. <laughs> that's not VIP. At all. I had no space to put my legs. No. <laughs> Move my legs a little bit to the right. I hate the guy's foot. No. <laughs> The regular movie theaters are bigger. Yeah. We have Lauren Young. Ten. York. Oh my gosh, I love downtown. We're walking towards this park so we can go to BFFs. Burgers for fries forever. Oh. Right? Right? I, I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, BFFs. I thought it was just called fries forever. Oh my <laughs> it's a burger place. Why would it call it? Anyway, it's going to be a really short segment because... Yeah, I should already know the vibe right now if you watch the vlogs. Movie is something after go home. So yeah. Oh my gosh, that's Aritzia. It's gonna be Aritzia. You have Aritzia money? There you go. <laughs> we'll see you guys when... Is it here? It says parking right above us. Is it here? Uh, it's not here, not here. Bro, we need to get These the shots. Ends. You live I'm not moving like a tourist. Already. I've been here multiple times. I need to get the shots. I'm about to edit it real nice. Say hi to the camera. I feel like you're a celebrity. I'm just your videographer. Okay, it's getting Hollywood. It's getting celebrity. What a loser. What a loser. Don't listen to the audience. <laughs> you were talking shit, eh? That's crazy. Today we're at Burgers and Fries. Burgers and Fries forever. Oh my god, sweet Jesus, I haven't had that in so long. Sweet Jesus. <laughs> sweet my lord and savior child. I can smell it already. Oh my god, I've been craving that burger forever. Hey, BFF. This is how it looks. Look, stealing your BFF. Her. But I got the American burger, which is cheese, caramelized onions, um, ketchup, mustard, pickles. I said no pickles, no mustard, okay? So. <gasps> I didn't eat, add bacon. Oh my god. I'm so annoyed. I didn't add bacon. You're 
to leave me to say something, but they have to charge me though. They're gonna charge you. <laughs> Make sure he doesn't touch the lettuce for me. It's me, bro. Pickles in here. <laughs> I'll take out the pickles, I don't care. But if there's mustard in there, we'd be pissed. There's, you're good, you're good. There's like four more pickles in there. Just open it up. I don't pickles. swear, now I don't swear. I see yellow in the camera. You know that's a key, that's a key. <laughs> what? <laughs> don't ask for a new one. We'll cry. Don't cry. I'm shy. <laughs> Gotta do it, man. Y'all, I'm having tickets to the look how good the burger looks. She hand delivered the burger to me. Slider. Okay, I'm gonna assume they're gonna come back tomorrow. I keep saying accepted delivery. Wow, that's a good one. That one's better than mine. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. Can I buy it? No, no, no. Do your thing, man. Do your thing. Do your thing. No, but think about it. See, this is what my barber was talking nah, about. Nah, put this on camera. Put this on camera. I want the camera to hear this. Okay. Listen. This is what my barber was talking about. Y'all women don't love men. <laughs> We asked you guys a simple thing. Hey, if we're putting the toilet seat down for you No, guys, but deep it. Put it up for us No, then, but deep right? it though. We're peeing and pooing sitting down. Half of the time of your stuff, it's sitting up or okay. standing up. But then that means I have to move the toilet seat twice when you only have to ever you move it once. Right? So if, let's say we're married, if you want to keep it balanced, we could do two, two. Nah, right? nah, man, that's what I'm trying to tell you. This is what my barber was talking about, man. Told me to stay Y'all hate for, women, that's for, it. No, <laughs> I promise. I promise you. I promise. All men love women more than women love. No. I can promise you that. Comment down below, guys. What do you think? I can promise you that. I, can... I just feel like humans just love themselves. Let's keep it there. Nah. Nah. You're done. You're done. Girl, I'm home. It's literally about to be midnight, but I don't know if I filmed this, but my camera dropped me home. Honestly, like, I have been away from people for so long <laughs> that, like, whenever we talk, it's an experience I can really appreciate. That might sound sad. You're just talking to people, like, gives you a rush? Yes. <laughs> Having genuine conversations with genuine people and, like, just being open is, like, it's, it does something to the soul. It does something to the heart. When you guys have good friends, appreciate them. Especially if they appreciate you for who you are and all your flaws. But yesterday, Sandrine slept over. We're doing Bible study, listening to music, watch Princess Diaries 1 and 2 even though she fell asleep. And like a key key. I haven't laughed hard like that in a long time. But yeah, I'm gonna see y'all maybe tomorrow. Today is Saturday, May 20th. A Saturday and Debbie's vlogging? I took work off because today is Grace's birthday dinner. We are going to Korean Grill House. We're supposed to go to Chaco, but they close at 10 and we're running really late and I'll explain everything once we get home. But right now we're really in a rush to leave. I'll see you guys when um at Korean Grill House, which is my first time being there too. So hopefully it's better than Chaco. Um, I'ma see y'all on the flip side. It's like my childhood, guys. Yeah, Jen, guys. <laughs> 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 
Dude, it's pineapple, thank God. Ooh, rice on the side. <laughs> pour it up, pour it up. Let it all fall out. Let it all fall out. Cheers to green. Yeah. Straight juice. Oh my god. That is like. Oh. Should we should we finish it? <laughs> Somebody pass me. Yo, she's quick. Yo. That's red. This is chaotic. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm gonna put it here. Guys, I did not record anything. You guys, it's literally- Yo. Yo. It's really giving Hunger Games because the way we were- <laughs> The way- Put down a beef and it would be gone the next second. I'm a snatch it. One thing about me- One of these. <laughs> oh, how unsuspicious. The criminal activity has just been taking place. Where's mine? Where's mine? Go pee, go piss, girl. Like I said, Hunger Games, like it was crazy, like it was going fast. I didn't even take any snaps, no pictures, so y'all are not gonna see nothing. No, like, but you just know, know we you, ate good. You know, if you're not taking no snaps, no nothing, that means we ate. We ate. We ate. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we had like two bottles of soju and I'm kind of tipsy guys. I'm not gonna lie. But I'm gonna go Period. We got no limit. We are the temple of Christ. So right now we're going home. And yeah, I really want to move my lashes guys. Oh my gosh, I haven't even shown you guys that I'm wearing lashes for the first time in a year. More than a year. I'm gonna go for a washroom. Yeah! Bye! I don't really want to be in it fully, but here we go. Listen, if you want my son, I'll be outside. Just say it, just say it. Malak, uh, you guys heard her voice, but I don't think I put her in the vlog. Is an angel. She dropped us all home. Base still holding up. Here's a stitch, guys. We were originally supposed to go to brunch, right? Which I was so excited about because I've never been to brunch and I really want to go to brunch. I low key do not really. I don't do makeup on the side, guys. <laughs> uh, whenever one of my aunts wants their makeup done, they hit me up and stuff. So my mom asked me to do it. My aunt's like, no. I got brunch. The time that she wanted to come was at four, so that wasn't gonna work. So my mom goes behind my back and asks Grace. Mind you, Grace is going to beauty school right now. Like she's literally gonna be a certified MUA, so she also does makeup. So Vishnu V, Grace's friend, came here and she was getting her makeup done by Grace because Grace wanted to, you know, practice more and everything. Our aunt, two hours late, she came at 6 p.m. I was in the middle of my makeup. Grace was almost done Vicious makeup and she was gonna, about to do her own but my mom was like hounding us down. Do her makeup, do her makeup. She has to go to an event, she has to go to an event. If that was the case, wouldn't she come at the appointed time? So, you know, we did her makeup, which was bomb by the way. And, but Korean Girl House is really good guys, if you wanna go. It was a fun time. The soju was flowing, the food was grilling. It was lit. Grace, would you like to come here for my camera dive? Oh yeah, if you're wondering why Linda didn't come, she had to work. Um, I had a time. Yeah. I got a Nike sweater. Oh my gosh, yeah. <laughs> I have fun with my homegirls. Turn up for real. I'm definitely going back. Next is Taco. Taco. <laughs> and we will be leaving earlier. I should definitely go to Korean barbecue grill with your friends. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's fun for a group of people. I just, I just deep this my first time going for a group of people. My favorite was the pork and the pineapple. The, was the beef was beautiful. Mm. And they seasoned it nicely. Yeah. Now the shrimp. We're never gonna talk about that. I even taste it. But from what the people will say, doo doo. Debbie and her dying camera. Okay, get out. <laughs> There's the door. There's the door. <laughs> I'm a free y'all whenever I do something fun. Oh, I'm getting my nails done on Wednesday. Guys, I'm here. Okay. Oh my god, you have a whole camera and everything? Yeah. <laughs> okay, um, what are you doing? The same picture you sent me, right? Yeah. Hey, 
<laughs> I get you home by a decent time. Wait, wait, sleep in mind. Yeah, let's make it happen, girl. I need some time. Speaking of time, who stopped it? That's the feeling that I get when we lie lips. I got the feed and the crib and the liquor too. I your soul, I release in your spiritual. I be your muse, bring your knees on the pencil. Here you go, you try and tease with them pictures. You could ride on me just like you ride the elliptical. She said, I'm trying to keep it tight for my nigga. Girl, I like your last nigga. All I need is mental. You know, I'll work you out, get you right with you. Yo, I just left. Oh, wait, that's another oh, you guys can't even see me. He knows beauty by nail by Cass and y'all can oh my gosh yeah, can I my nails? oh my gosh guys these are so cute I was really supposed to visit Candace but she's at her aunt's house I haven't had McDonald's in a long time but that's for a reason because it's nasty but it can slap sometimes so I'm gonna check on the McDonald's app if there's anything I'm still confused as to what's happening but all I do know is that we're going to McDonald's guys we're going to McDonald's Hey guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> hey guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. It's me. <laughs> hey guys, it's me, Candace. Welcome, welcome back to my channel. Yeah. Okay. Hey guys. I don't like that. I'm like, <laughs> okay. Okay, 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 okay. Hey guys, it's your girl Candace. Welcome, welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a weekly vlog. I'm here with uh, Debbie. Please follow her YouTube channel. It's uh, Debbie Shaed. Jade. <laughs> Jade. This week, I'm really going to give you guys a lot of content. So I plan on doing a lot of get ready with me. Mm. I'm going to be my little sister behind the camera right there. Um, I, I did her nails by the way. That's crazy. <laughs> and um, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to see more content. Yeah, that was the most cringiest thing I've ever witnessed in my Jane life. Mm -hmm. What was that thing? <gasps> what, what was it? You see me walking in the hall, you know it's me. <laughs> chin, 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 chin. Oh, guys, I'm taller than her. What Girl, I'm going to be taller yourself right now. Um, last time <laughs> we were upstairs in my room, we oh. were talking about someone, people, stuff, places, things. I'm sorry, cut that off. Mm -mm. Cut the cameras. Yes. <laughs> hey y'all, I'm in the washroom because <laughs> there's no free spaces in my house. It's quiet. Y'all probably like, if you're new here, like, who the heck is this little 12 year old girl? <laughs> um, basically, um, she's sisters with my friend. We used to be best friends. We're not best friends anymore, but like, that's still my dog. Like, I worked at her school when she was in elementary school. Her mom knows my mom's too. Congress community and that stuff. So like, we just became sisters. Um, that's really my sister. So um, that's who Candace is. But literally, we talked, chopped it up. She updated me on her life. I don't have anything to update her on. We broke binge watching. Not really. Watched four episodes only of a bot elementary that was really nice now i'm here i'm about to eat got my laptop y'all know the drill i gotta be watching some youtube some something i'm gonna end up the vlog here i will see you guys either next week or tomorrow every time i do this transition i never do it out but hopefully that in the future does it so It's like over a week later and the date is Thursday, June 1st. Happy June, guys. I haven't vlogged in a minute, but yesterday I filmed the video. So I'm just going to edit today. I have a meeting at four for like a potential business venture. Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> um, I want to do my makeup. No, that's not the only reason why I want to do my makeup. I got some of my sheen stuff. Open to the movements of your heart. Your gaze, my world starts changing. Death could not hold you. I failed 
Done. So, Sheen Hall, May Sheen Hall. I only got four things. I got these acrylic frames. I was watching a vlog a minute ago, and this girl had these glasses and she had them on vacation. They look cute. And I discovered her from Sheen. I was so happy because I was not going to drop money on clear glasses. Oh, shut up. It looks so cute. <gasps> oh my gosh. This is the look I was going for. I was so... Y'all know the ones when you have new clothes, new anything. You just gotta do your makeup and your hair and you're good. This is exactly what I was looking for. Okay, next thing. I'm gonna keep these on because they're so cute. Next thing. Basic. I just re-upped on the piercing. I thought I lost it, but I found it again. So I ordered it for no reason still. But you can never have too much, right? If you don't know, my piercings are fake. You guys should notice. When I was younger, I really wanted to pierce my nose. But I literally just like the look of it. And then I got these earrings and I have two pairs. So I have a white pair, white. They're like more cream. And I also got clear ones and they're so cute. Oh my gosh, I saw them on Pinterest and I saw that you can get them on Sheen and I was like, <gasps> they're cute. They're so cute. I feel so expensive. Like, <gasps> imagine if I like, I did not, I need to wax my pits, guys. Okay, I need to wax them. I didn't wax them in so long, so please don't mind them. Let me actually go like this. Let me not traumatize you. Oh my gosh. No, I feel like a fashion, a fashion icon. Ah! I really like this. A fashion icon. What's, what's the lyrics? Audrey Hepburn? I don't know. Yes, yeah, some Nicki lyric. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna tie my hair. No, I have to. I miss my haul era, guys. Like, <gasps> I'm feeling torn. But yeah, that's all I got from Shein. Honestly, guys, I really try to force myself to buy clothes, but it just wasn't giving. Nothing was giving. And if you watch my get ready with me, you know that I'm really, really, really trying to opt for high quality basics. And I'm tired of buying trendy statement pieces when I'm just a regular girl. Like, I don't be going to events or whatever. I be going to Walmart. Not even. I go to work. I wear a uniform. So it's like, why am I buying a flamingo pink asymmetric maxi shredded dress? It doesn't make sense. I have less than an hour to clean a bit, so... I'm gonna be doing a bit of that, looking like this. Learn fashion icon, or do you burn? I'm gonna keep you hold it one turn. They don't want to whip dark, just to bend the barbie. From the heat to a sizzle lane, so I can pull on you. I'm gonna fast and pray to send my body. Abstain me from sex, have to send my body. You gotta be king status to defend my body. You gotta be husband status. Yeah, cause the queen is what I am by. Toodles. <laughs> okay guys i randomly decided to wax because it's been overdue okay if you guys are like haters and you pay attention to my armpits like for the past what two months three months yeah i got you so i'm on the phone of gloria the meeting's happening in four minutes so hopefully i get this down in one minute because i want to talk to her for three <laughs> ouch that's hot Ooh, that joint is hot we got the wax on Okay, if I put it upwards, I should remove it downwards. Okay. Y'all ready? I really hope this is a one and done. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna lie. It's been a minute, guys. I'm scared. Oh! Wow! Clean! That was clean! Whoa. Don't play with me. Oh my gosh, and it's so smooth. I'm gonna rinse it off with water a bit. Okay, next time. Okay, the wig. <gasps> it just got on my thigh. Oh my gosh. Okay. That should cover the whole patch. I'm gonna pull hard enough, but this is my left hand. Ay! Yay, yo, 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 yo. That was absolutely next level, I'm not gonna lie. I'm hair free! Ah! Okay, let me go to the meeting, guys, and I'll let you guys know how it goes.
If you don't wax, guys, please wax. Shaving is horrible for you. Later. watch if you played just dance you know okay go. hey guys uh, it is june 6th and i got my wig <laughs> i got my wig i got my wig i ordered a wig from reshine this wig's from reshine and you guys know that i do hair reviews but it's really good i'm not doing them no more because nobody's searching for them and I'm just waiting for my Aritzia package. It was supposed to come, what, two days ago? But it should be coming tomorrow, so I'm gonna give y'all that haul. Ooh, got the HD wig cap. Oh my gosh, they really plucked this joint. Guys. Guys. I just want to show you guys the wig. Ah! I'm going out on Thursday with Umi and Tay. I haven't seen them in so long. You guys haven't seen them even longer. But I want something new. Something fresh. I'm, I'm gonna go dye the wig and do it all I gotta do. I'm gonna see y'all later. Y'all, it's literally six hours later. I'm done the whole customization process. It's looking good, baby. It's dyed, it's bleached. I didn't even have to pluck it, y'all. I was supposed to start Bible study 30 minutes ago, but they're most likely gonna call any minute because it's literally now the dot. And then there's the dye. Got dye here. It's gonna freaking be here. See, Bible study starting. And here okay let me answer them Thanks. so what are we doing sorry silly question but what book are we reading again <laughs> first corinthians But the person without the spirit does not receive what comes from God's spirit because it is foolishness to him. What? Don't say it. He is not able to understand it since it is evaluated spiritually. The spiritual person, however, can evaluate everything and yet he himself cannot be evaluated by anyone. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay. <laughs> Nah, I'm literally highlighting this whole chapter. I got a meeting. Dama mi samale, dama mi samale. Whoa, 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 whoa. He's so black. He said I'm gonna send you the link right away. It's been two minutes. Dama mi samale. Am I even singing it right, guys? That's crazy. I'm not going out tomorrow. Wow, what happened? Um, Umi's friend did like a literally a last minute birthday dinner. I'm back from my test and I just bawled my eyes out because I'm panicking. And there's no way that I was gonna restart my whole face. That would have sent me into a coma. <laughs> oh yeah, and don't mind my the bottom half of my face. I'm there's no way I'm correcting it and this is really irritating me. Oh my gosh, this is the vlog where you guys are gonna see that I passed my driving test. So I've done my makeup, I've done my hair, which I love. I'm in love with my hair. But I'm gonna give you guys this haul real quick. I'm trying on these 
earrings for the first time and they're very cute i just wish they were white or they're cream but they're very cute i feel very expensive especially with my hair stuff come on okay there you go so first i got the sunday's best lisp crop tee this is not the color in real life it's a bit more it's less gray more on the bluish green side but i have the long sleeve version of it so like i want the crop top version i most likely should have went for a 2xs but it's okay and then i got the sunday's best is it honor tank i think yes the honor cropped tank if you know me you know i love me a nice white top simple and it's like a wife beater vibes but it's like on the website it looks really high and i like that look so hopefully that's how it looks on me very simple i got the sunday's best long sleeve crop top in a maroon red this is the last one on the website really cute this is not really the color scheme for summer but if i want to slap something on i got this um but this is good for fall time i know it's the last one so if i wanted to wear it for fall i most likely would have not got it because it would have been sold out so now loki to start the show i got the oh everything sunday's best that's crazy i got the sunday's best cinch seamless t-shirt i think it's the crop top in black so yeah that's what i got and uh, i'm gonna try it on right now obviously you guys are gonna see how it looks and stuff and then i'm gonna get my final review in order okay see y'all it is the next day and i did my makeup to motivate myself because today is my driving test this is a default that i won't cry aka i will pass okay i'm really hungry i'm not gonna lie i'm gonna be on my way to port union if you're from here you know that's where everybody passes but i'm gonna be practicing with my driving instructor for i'm guessing two hours because my test is at 310 if you didn't watch me get rid of me please pray for me i believe that prayer is timeless so whatever prayer you pray anytime after i post this video because obviously today is the day of the test i truly believe because god is outside of time he will answer those prayers okay i'll change of plans my driving instructor is downstairs He's picking me up. I don't know. I feel nothing. <coughs> I feel apathetic. Is that how you say the word? Hopefully that's a good thing. But I'll let you guys know how the practice goes. Hopefully I'll have time to check in in between before my test. So I'm going to see y'all. I'm going to do it. Bye. <laughs> Y'all, I was just at the Arama to get snacks. I'm in the driving center, like parking lot basically. My driving instructor is getting in the car and I need to do some Gatorade, guys. Pray for me, pray for me, pray for me. I'm gonna ask until I'm done this test. I don't know what time it is, but it's almost my appointment. Wish me luck, but I'm about to get in the car, so he's gonna diss me for having chips for breakfast, but it's okay. We love an instructor who cares, but I'll see you guys. She yeah. said it Guys, oh my goodness, you guys, I was very much shaking it. <gasps> By the grace of God, I passed. Really, no long talks. I passed, period. Was I nervous? Was my leg literally shaking? Like, d -d 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 -d. yes, it was. Could I most likely fail? Yes, but God really touched that driver instructor's heart. I just want to drive right now. I'm gonna do like a story time doing like my next get ready with me and stuff, but then shout out to Abdul, shout out to Abdul. If you're in Scarborough, not even he I've heard that he has students in Oshawa. Call Abdullah. I'll put his information down below because he's a godsend. If you keep up with the vlogs and my videos, you know that I've been driving for like literally two months. Obviously before that I had some lessons, like two maybe. Stay telling you guys, driving itself is fine, it's just parking. And the driving instructor didn't focus too much on parking but i slapped on the parallel park though if you're looking to drive and stuff and you want a good instructor hit up abdul i'm gonna get back to you guys most likely tomorrow but later today if there's anything interesting happening it's him building us to the time we're going to be ready but also taking care of us in that season We should be mindful about how we speak to people and what I wrote down is that we speak we need to speak to people at their level. Mm -hmm. So like Paul was over here saying, I can't be telling you about demons and all these the deeper things in the faith because you're just at a baby level. That's what is giving you milk, you know, the basics. Um, and also to be understanding and discerning. Just because somebody's a believer or somebody says they believe in God, doesn't mean you have to straight away go into the deep stuff, you know? So you need to really assess like are they able to understand? Are they open to understanding? All these things you need to like 
you know, reevaluate how you speak to people, how you approach the people when it comes to the gospel, right? What popped up for me from what you said, because I didn't highlight this until now, um, the second half of verse 2, in fact, you are still not ready because you are still worldly. I just thought about how when it comes to things that God puts on our hearts, we feel like we're ready, but it's not happening yet, da 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 We wait for things. It's because of this part of the verse, because obviously we're believers, we're not in the world, but we still have like worldly tendencies, I guess. So like for me, I guess that would be... Um, Oh, perfect example. Holy Spirit just attacked me. When I tell you guys, like, if I had an issue and I was able to leave the country, I'm the type to literally run away from my problems. Like, I will hop on a plane and leave. Like, that's the... Been like, there. Oof. Done that. Like, Been that there. is me. Obviously, there's nothing wrong with traveling itself, because he knows, like, I love traveling. But it's because instead of coming to him for my problems, I would resort to that thing to run away from my problems, which is a worldly perspective. So he doesn't bless us with things or tell us things or all these things because we still have a worldly perspective in some areas of our life. So yeah, I have to highlight that in blue, which is Loki the Holy Spirit talking to you. So yeah. I love what you said about um, speaking to people based on their spiritual levels. levels yeah. Hey y'all, I don't know how many days later it is, but today is it's probably a week or something. I'm really about to start another vlog. I just want to come here because I wanted to cool off the vlog with y'all and stuff. I just wanted to come here and do the highs and lows with y'all. Let me just look back at the footage because I never be remembering what I've been doing. I would say my low was the day before my driver's test. Y'all saw the weight. I had to read through my under eyes. The day before the test was really crazy. It was just really nerve wracking. So I would say that would be my low. My high is obviously me getting my driver's license. Your girl's Paul Rhodes. Okay, I passed. By the grace of God, I passed. Like I've explained, we had a two hour lesson and then he showed me the root of the test. When I was vlogging me getting out of Dalarama, Abdul literally fed me. Like clearly, like he ate like a little one, two bites of his food, but he gave the rest to me because he knows every time we do driving lessons, he knows when I don't eat. Which is almost every single driver like that. And if you know me, I'm picky. I don't like eating other people's food, all that stuff. But something about Middle Eastern and Indian people. Just their vibe. It's just like, they want to take care of you and stuff. Da, da, da. In a really wholesome way. It was actually good too. It was like my first time eating Afghan food. But when I'm saying by the grace of God, I'm not joking because my driver instructor, Loki, not Loki, he had the grounds to fail me. <laughs> I felt like I was doing a good job, which I was. But could I have done better? Yes. If I had somebody mean that day, couldn't they have failed me? Of course. So, like, clearly we would have to thank Jesus um, for me passing. So, yeah, that's obviously my high. This whole vlog, I'm looking back at the footage and it's like, wow. Life life is life thing, but in a good way. My circle is kind of getting bigger. After this paycheck, my money is going to enjoyment. Okay, not like, obviously bills, but no more debts. Okay, more saving more enjoyment, car more rentals. fun, car rentals. <laughs> Even though lately, like, uh, spiritually it's just like, eh. But I know deep down that like, something really good is gonna come up, so. Yeah, but I really have to go. If you guys enjoyed this vlog, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure to follow me on my social media, it should be down below. And make sure to turn on your post notifications so that you know if I the next time that I post, I'm actually posting. Okay, okay. I love you guys so much, and I'll definitely see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.